from Astronaut in the Ocean by Mass Wolf. What you know about rolling down in the deep? And Duncan Lawrence's Arcade. To Beggin' by Maniskin. I'm begging, begging you. Music helps to make some of the best online challenges. We're continuing the 100th week celebration of our Billboard Global Charts. And today we're looking at a few of the biggest crossovers from TikTok to the charts. TikTok success stories predate the launch of the Global Charts, with the most obvious path to a viral moment being a dance challenge. Dance challenges don't always appear when a song is released. Lizzo's About Damn Time debuted on the April 30th dated Global 200 and number 74, and fell to number 133 the following week. Feeling fussy, walking in my Balenciennes, trying to bring out the fat beard lust. That's when a viral dance challenge kicked in, immediately sending the song back to number 12 and eventually to number 6. Noah Cyrus helped me get in on the challenge. In a minute, I'ma need a sentimental man or woman to pump me up. It might appear that a song needs a high BPM and intense theatrics for TikTok to help with global success, but several ballads have crossed through, including Glimpse of Us by Joji. Cause sometimes I look in her eyes and that's where I find a glimpse of us. Despite never previously making the Global 200's top half, or the global excluding US chart at all, Glimpse of Us debuted in the top 10 of both, backed by TikTokers using the song as a backdrop to their videos. After arriving on the charts at number six and nine respectively, the song shot to number two on both rankings and remains in the top 10 today. Usually when a song goes viral on TikTok, it's because thousands of users contributed content to help boost the track. Though there is that rare occasion when a single video creates a swell of commotion. That's never been more true than when Nathan Apodaca, aka Dogface, skateboarded along a highway drinking ocean spray juice, lip syncing to Fleetwood Mac's dreams. That one video spread far and wide, generating thousands of duets with Shakira getting in on the popularity. And Fleetwood Mac members Mick Fleetwood and Stevie Nicks. Ultimately sending the then 43-year-old song to number 10 on the Global 200. See our full coverage celebrating the 100th week of our global charts, head to Billboard.com. I'm Tetris Kelly for Billboard News.